Believe it or not, the concept of a lift dates back to ancient times. Ancient Greeks and Egyptians used basic lifts powered by people, animals, or water. But the modern elevator, as we know it, has a unique origin. It was in 1853 that an American inventor named Elisha Otis demonstrated the first safe passenger elevator at the New York World's Fair. Otis had invented a safety brake that prevented elevators from falling if the hoisting rope broke, a revolutionary concept that would make elevators safe and reliable. Otis's invention was simple yet brilliant. A system of spring-loaded arms would catch on the sides of the shaft if the rope failed. This innovation turned the elevator from a dangerous machine into a practical and safe way to transport people and goods. Otis installed the first public elevator in a department store in New York City in 1857. It moved at about 40 feet per minute, much slower than today's elevators, but it transformed architecture and allowed cities to grow vertically, not just horizontally. Thanks to Otis's invention, buildings could now soar higher than ever before, paving the way for the skyscrapers that define our modern cities.